Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for phase two of the drama content. You thought it was bad yesterday? No. I took a sleep, I woke up, and dear lord, the Discord is popping off. Everything is in flames. The derangedness of these mentally ill losers that I ban, it just got worse. And TLDR, here, let me, let me give you a breakdown of what's going on at a high level, because we're going to go into detail later. But essentially, there is this loser, S01, who got banned from my community for being a piece of shit. And now he's going around, taking on the name under this channel, Frazier8160, but changing their profile pictures and username as, you know, frequent members from my community, then going on to the Brothers Yo channel and basically talking shit. That is basically at a high level what's going on. But let me just reiterate, for people that's new to this drama, let me explain to you what's going on. So, the Brothers Yo is a fantastic anime channel that you guys go check out for wise man grandchild reactions. And because their episode one popped the fuck off, getting like 20,000 views, I saw that shit and I was like, you know what? I want to put my bid in too. So I put a little community goal. Guys, I know that we pulled for this and it's lost, but if you guys can prove to me, if you guys can prove to me that if you, like, like, if you guys can prove to me that you want to actually watch this, give me 10k views. And it almost did that. In fact, it's actually doing so well, we're probably going to watch that. I'll make a separate video on that. But after, you know, the haters saw this, look what happens on the Brothers Yo channel. Right? Yuichi is a, a frequent member of my channel, and they said, Haha, Kaka just reacted to episode one of the series and talks about you guys' smiley face, right? And got a little heart with the, with the 13 likes. Nothing wrong there. All peaceful. CJ comes in with Moyai emotes as base as usual. And this motherfucker yesterday, if you saw a drama video, yeah, he jealous, got corrected immediately. Edit! He is not. And yeah, that's my fault for jumping to conclusion. Go fuck yourself still, but I appreciate the fact that you apologize. And then there's a guy, and a guy saying, who? And here's the interesting part. And I want you to be very aware of this character here. Shadow64488. And he says, there is an anime reactor Kaka TV. He has just watched one episode of Wise Man's Grandchild because he saw that the Brothers Yo's getting good views. So he's copying. His reaction is also well. Everything he said here, absolutely true. Absolutely true. I am copying. I know that my audience shares an overlap with their audience. And I know that if I make a video on it, if my audience actually gives a fuck, they'll click on the video and do well. That's simply YouTube. You think that they have ownership over Wise Man Grandchild? They don't. No one actually fucking thinks that. His reaction is also well. This also doesn't really matter to me. You know why? Do you know why I don't think this matters? Because you have different opinions about what you think is good. But I have factual fucking numbers. And let's look at the numbers for Wise Man Grandchild. Views are 2.1 times higher than usual. This is episode one. Hitting 6,000, 21 new subs. Watch times fucking cracked out the wazoo. Views are cracked out the wazoo. But the thing that I'm experimenting here is hopefully that uh, YouTube will see that the community effort was good, then spike it and send it off to a totally separate audience to then, you know, um, basically boost the momentum. And that's how you get to those 10K plus 20K numbers. And that's exactly what I was trying to experiment, right? If my viewers saw that the video sucked, if the people on YouTube saw that my video wasn't good, they wouldn't be clicking. They wouldn't be watching this. Yet they did. So your opinion literally does not fucking matter. Let's continue. That's hilarious, but not surprising. Dude's really annoying. I don't know what the fuck I did to Mr. De Veggie, but seeing as his recent comments here on, you know, Brothers Yo channel is about solo leveling, he probably says some dumb shit on my solo leveling videos. I probably called him a fucking monkey because he deserved it. Ka is so annoying. Now he is making new views by using Brother Yo name. Truly what an L man. It's so funny. Like, you have no understanding of how YouTube works. You think that I can simply get easy views by just making a wise man grandchild reaction? It doesn't fucking work like that. You do it. Anyone else can do it. But it's not going to work the same way because their audience is not built for that content. Because I know that we share the audience and I know that my audience also pulled for it. I had good confidence that it would do well and there was a calculated guess. But what the fuck do you mean that I'm using the brother's own name? Are, are you fucking deranged? Dude, you need therapy. Flawed personality traits. No one cares. Very based. Very based from Phil Davis Plus. And Turbo8995 comes out 18 hours ago saying, You spend your time watching other people watch anime. You are more sad and pathetic. Go get a life. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> 
Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold the fuck up. Yo, chill the fuck out. I don't think there's anything wrong with reaction content. I enjoy reaction content. Bro didn't take any side. Bro said, fuck Kaka TV. Fuck brothers, yo. Fuck you monkeys in chat too. Y'all are fucking losers. Honestly, honestly, kind of hilarious. Kind of fucking base, right? And here comes again, look at the handle here. I want you to be very aware of the handle you see here that says Frazier, but it has an extra O at the end and 8160. Bro, he didn't say anything wrong. Plus, Ka is also abusing Brother Yo. He is more pathetic. How am I abusing Brothers Yo? I've spoken nothing but positive things about them. I've even mentioned them multiple times in my stream, saying that they're one of the inspirations, a channel that I studied when my channel was doing bad and they were growing at a faster rate even though they were a smaller channel. And by understanding what's going on, putting the insecurities aside and studying their channel, I was able to realize and how to really create a community. And we've been thriving. And brothers, yo, I have to thank them for that. But how do you mean that I am abusing them? The fact that I made a fucking episode one reaction off of a different fucking channel? Could you then not make the same fucking argument for every motherfucker that reacts to the same fucking weekly series? You have no fucking principal stance. No one is taking you fucking seriously. You think that the Brothers Yo is gonna watch this and be like, yep, random commenter is saying this shit even though we talk behind the scenes. Don't you think that CCs behind the scenes are very aware of what's going on? You're so fucking stupid to think that this is gonna happen. And this was phase one yesterday. This comment thread is phase one. I didn't even get started on the drama, by the way. This is set up for phase one. Now, enter phase two. Last night, when I was about, oh boy, 26 replies here. Oh boy. Here we go. Last night, I was about to go to bed. And I saw my fucking phone buzzing and pinging. I'm like, what the fuck is going on Discord? And I was like, oh shit. Phase two is happening. Bro, and again, this is not the real Frazier. I want you to understand this. Kaka is using your names for views, and then he is abusing you both in live. And here's the funny thing. Ready? Look at this comment. And look at this. Do you guys see a similarity here between what Frazier O said, the fake Frazier said here? Using your names for views and he is abusing you both in live. And this. Maybe S0 commented this and then realized, hmm, maybe the brothers yo will take me more seriously if I change my YouTube handle and YouTube name. He literally changed the YouTube handle and YouTube name to emulate some of the more prominent figures in my community that's very active. So that they think that they're gonna take them more seriously. Which is a very funny fucking idea. You think that Brothers Yo gonna know, you know? You think that, like, this is a different level of mental illness, terminally online level, to the point you think that Brother Yo is gonna recognize Fraser. And no disrespect, right? I'm not saying that Fraser is insignificant. No, we are all insignificant in the grand theme of things. But this guy is so fucking terminally online, so fucking deep in his mental illness, he thought that this is a good strategy. And that's why the name you see here, right here, says Frazier, even though it has a Saber profile picture. And we'll get to that because multiple times, right? His name is Saber right now because Saber is also another member of my community. And it's not that. And here's the original Frazier, by the way. The original Frazier has Frazier with uncapitalized letters 0816. This channel was created, you know, uh, fucking September 14th, right? It's a real channel. But this channel, when was it created? February 2nd, 2024. And I want you to look at this number real quickly. And we're going to do a little callback to one of the earlier comments from a guy named Shadow. Actually, we can shave that later. This is a little hint, but basically, Shadow and Frazier, they have the same date that they, they created their account. So I think you can kind of make the connections in your head onto who's responsible for this. It's most likely this deranged fucking lunatic, right? So here, let's read the parent thread. Kaka is using your names for views. And he is abusing you both in live. 26 replies. At this point, I feel like I have to fucking... I, I feel like I should, like, send, you know, a formal apology to Brothers Yo. Because, like, listen, I banned this motherfucker. But he's still going out doing these retard shit somewhere else. I feel like I'm somewhat responsible for this. But at some point, where is the accountability from the, you know, the owner's end? So what is he doing exactly? He is abusing you in live. He is saying they don't have brain. Okay, English for a second. He is me. He is abusing you. Brothers Yo is you. He is me. He is saying, which is me, they don't have brain. Who is they? 
I'm gonna assume this is broken English and brothers yo they don't have brain to running YT channel they are getting view because of me and many more things immediately broken English and he's probably someone that's not you know from North America probably a deranged motherfucker in the other side of the planet it is what it is and then my man honey for who tao let's fucking go woo, woo, woo. this is my dog right here bro she was out there during the fucking fraud lot of scams drama and fucking kawaii cruise channel going out to fucking bat for me bro bro spreading misinformation so hard just because he got banned by kaka and you see that heart you see that fucking heart? Ooh, hearted by the brothers. Yo, I wonder who he's believing. And then here comes the fraud again. At Honey for Hu Tao. When you don't know anything. So just stifu. He did say all this in his Twitch live. Where's the proof? Give me the proof. Give me the fucking evidence. Do you know why I make my Discord a public thing on my Twitch? Do you know why I'm perfectly fine with rats being present in my live streams and my Discord? I have nothing to fucking hide. I'm squeaky fucking clean. We simply stick to anime. We're not a drama channel. I simply put my head down and grind the content. Other people seize the animes that we're enjoying. We grow, but then sometimes there are retards like this that's gonna throw shade that tries to start shit because of their own fault. And then I gotta respond to the drama. I don't create drama. I simply respond to drama. And here is Corin coming in, another longtime community member. Bro spreading misinformation because bro got banned on his channel, Lamau. Maddox, my man, impersonating one's cause community members and spreading false information. You should go outside and touch some grass. And Shiroi right here, he was also a victim of this. Why? Because Shiroi also got his name and profile picture stolen by this fucking fraud to make it seem like he's a bad guy. How ignorant do you have to be as a human being to think this? He gave credit where it's due, and even said he was inspired by Brothers Yo. He has said nothing bad about them. Stop spreading misinformation. More hearts on these comments. And here's the real Frasier. Remember, the real Frasier is the one with the uncapitalized letter here. Bro, I know you hate cost so much, but why do you need to impersonate me to prove your point? Here, I just want to enjoy some animes, and some guys are trying to impersonate me for, being, uh, for people just to believe you. Shame on you, man. And that's the thing. I feel bad for you guys, because you guys are fucking getting dragged in, right? Like, imagine... Like... Imagine, at a bigger scale, if, like, this guy had a bigger platform, and he would just say defamatory shit by just, like, you know, role-playing, just fucking cosplaying, just catfishing as other community members. It would feel fucking bad. You did no fucking wrong. And now he's trying to drag other community members' name on the fucking dirt because he can't fucking get back into my community. It's actually deranged lunatic behavior. And here's the fake Frasier. Stafu! If you don't know anything, then stop giving me advice. Okay, am I the one that's crazy? Or, like, like so far, we... Our community members, we are the coming in with receipts. We're coming in with evidence, direct examples. And all this guy keeps saying is, you don't know anything. Stay out of this business. You don't know anything. But it's like, okay, where's the proof? Where's the evidence? It should be so fucking easy, right? L Maddox, I don't expect this from you. You know why I said this? This is the funniest shit. Because he was very active in my Discord. And let me show you this. You see this name here? This ban list, S0? That's right. Motherfucker got fucking banned. Motherfucker got banned from my Discord. And every day, he would talk to Frazier, Shiroi, Maddox, and maybe have a good time. And now, he feels like he's been betrayed by his comrades. How could you take Kaka's side in this? You know, I got banned for being a dumbass. Now I'm impersonating you and, be, and trying to frame different content creators to make sure that they get into fake drama. And you're gonna side with them and not me? Like, what kind of line of thinking is this? Like, you think that you're the good guy here? You straight up think you're the good guy here? And let me do something a little personal here. All right, right? I, I saved this. I, I saved this just for this moment. Are you guys ready to do something? Are you guys ready to see something? I'm about to do something that's gonna change everything. Here's the Discord. I'm not, sh you guys can't really see this. I, I can't really enlarge the Discord right now. Can I? I? I can't really. But basically, this is a server list of emotes. And you guys can't see this, but this is uh, S0's uh, dis uh, Discord uh, emotes that he put in. Hold up, hold up. Let me, let me show you a better picture, a better picture, okay? Just, just to prove to you what's going on, okay? 
Here it is. Here it is. You guys see this shit? You, do you guys see the emotes that he put in? Are you ready? I'm gonna now delete every single one of them. Mm -hmm. That's one gone. That's two gone. That's three gone. That's four gone. Fuck you. Fuck you and your emotes. I say that just for this fucking moment. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I'm so petty. Oh yeah, I don't give a fuck. New emotes are opened up, boys. Go make your emotes. All right, there's that little section. All right, all right, get back to the actual drama. Let's get back to the actual drama. Let's read the rest of this fucking thread. Ready? Here we go. Using, uh, and here comes Salise. Here comes Salise. There's also stickers. We'll get rid of those later. Using a community member's name and spreading misinformation about Kaka TV won't do you any benefit. You should go get a life outside of these social media platforms. Sick people will not get help until they hit rock bottom. This lunatic is not gonna stop. He's a toxic piece of shit that's gonna go to other people's platforms and say bad things about me. But you know what? We all talk behind the scenes, different content creators. You don't think that we know delusional people like this? Who do you think is gonna listen? Who, like, what do you think that other reaction channels are gonna listen to? You think that they're gonna listen to some random ass fucking YouTube channel that just got created that has no fucking comments in your channel? Or me, like, like another fucking, like a, like a colleague in the same space. Like it's, it's mind boggling that you think that this is going to work. You didn't expect me to tell the truth or what? Maddox replying to, you know, Fraser. And here is Max again, bro. Why you are telling lie. You are the one you sent me to say all of that. <laughs> bro, he's actually trying to pivot this and saying, no, Maddox did this. No, no, Maddox did this. No. I didn't do this. You told me to do this. <laughs> Grasping at fucking straws as he realizes that our community members are just straight up roasting him with fucking facts and logic. He's throwing Max under the table. What do you mean? You told me to do this. <laughs> Corin says the real Frazier is in this thread. Why don't you get some balls to respond to the dude? How is what I'm telling a lie? And here comes Greg Taylor. And Greg Taylor says, Bro, you're weird as fuck to the fraud. He put a video up from his stream and didn't say anything like that. And here comes Rhino Shizura 6186. And what did he say? This whole thread is a cancer. I agree. I am so sorry that my ex retards, they're not my retards anymore. They're, 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 they are excommunicated, okay? I hope you guys don't actually believe the people who's trying to cause drama here when Kaw hasn't said anything mean about you guys at all. In fact, he said on this latest video that you both are an inspiration to do better. Another heart! I think the people, I think everyone here understands what's going on except the fucking fraud. And here comes Saber. And this is the real Saber, by the way. And notice his Saber profile picture. That's why currently he has his, um, the fraud right now has the profile picture as because he was also impersonating uh, no, Frazier. Sorry, he's also in, in, uh, impersonating uh, Saber. Bro, why are you impersonating me? And Ka didn't abuse them. Don't spread misinformation. Go get a life. Stop doing this. He also said he was inspired by them. And here comes the fraud again with the same Saber picture. I'm not in impersonating you. You are the one who changed name and P profile picture, not me. You are the real one. You're the one that changed the profile picture. Okay, here's the fake one, by the way. Here's the, here's the, here is Frazier as Shinoi. Here is Frazier as Saber. And the, the real one is, uh, the real one is S0. But right now, and, and, and then Frazier is the original one that he fucking handled. Like, bro, your YouTube handle is literally the fraudulent Frazier. Like, what are you fucking talking about? How, how could you fucking say this? Everyone knows that who is real and who is fake. Stop doing this cringe activities, get some help. Maddox says, ha, 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 I think you forgot about the YouTube handle. You have Frazier's handle with Saber's name and profile picture. Bro, what are you on? And you know what the funniest thing is? Yes, I'm the real one, you freak. Bro didn't realize. Bro didn't realize that he can't change the fucking YouTube handle immediately after you change it once. Because remember, it was S0 in the beginning. Then he tried to make it to Frazier fraudulent one. Then he got stuck with it. So he's like, oh shit. I can't put on different masks anymore. They know. And here's the best part. In comes Shadow 64488. And why is this name important? 
because this is the same guy who was on the earlier comments. Remember? He's one of the first guys that was out here talking shit about me. And here's a very, very interesting thing. Once he got caught red fucking handed and couldn't fucking realize what to do, he called backup. But you know what the best thing about the backup is? Look at his channel. Five comments on this channel, it says. On this channel, there's fucking five comments. Do you think that a person that watches Brothers Year would only have five comments straight on only one of this video, the drama video? Wise Man's episode six? That's already suspicious enough. And if you go look, and if you go look at Shadow's, you know, YouTube handle, this was created February 3rd, 2024. Same with the fraudulent Frazier, February 3rd, 2024. What do you guys think is happening here? Maybe they're good friends. Yep, they, they, they just gotta be really good friends that has each other's back, that created their YouTube accounts at the same exact time. Or is this motherfucker so fucking delusional? He has alt account ready to go to fucking argue against other people because he realizes he's getting fucking roasted in the fucking thread. I got no backup. I look like a fucking idiot. Let me bring my fucking alt account to do this. This is not the first time someone has done this before. In fact, the previous data live lunatics, the ones where I called Yoshino a fraud because the puppet Yoshino was not, you know, was ventriloquism. Someone took that seriously. And then, no, and there was also the Kurumi hate, right? There, there was people arguing about how like, oh, Kurumi got donated, you know, Mio's better. And people had a fucking mental like disaster they had a fucking stroke and then they called alt accounts to fucking you know fight back that's what's happening here this dude is not real these dudes are fucking fake look at this shit yes i'm the real one you freak says the motherfucker with the old fraser youtube handle everyone can fucking see this and then here he goes shadow says he goes he hops back on the other account he goes doop, doop, let me switch accounts you are the one who is doing wrong stop bullying him idiots isn't that crazy Bro is getting straight up fucking clap roasted. Absolutely fucking deserved. You deserve to get bullied. You got banned for doing a being a toxic piece of shit. You got banned from the community. You made a fucking alt account to impersonate other people. You try to throw shade about different content creators on other people's channel to fabricate drama. You then try to impersonate other community members and drag their name in the dirt. And then when you get called out for all that shit, you're saying that we're bullying you and we should stop? Fuck you. You deserve this shit. Fuck around and find out. You're literally finding out right now. And oh my God, this is so perfect. You know why? You know why this is so good? You are arrogant losers. Stafu, he's not copying. You are the one who is doing freak motherfucker. Look at your video channel, five comments, same fucking guy. And at the end, we end off with the laughing emote. And here's the best part about, oh, oh, oh wait, one thing. After he did all this shit, Y'all thought the drama ended here. Nope, drama didn't end here. This motherfucker got cooked. He realized the brothers yo ain't listening. Nobody's fucking listening. You know what happened? This is to notify that we have received a privacy complaint from an individual stating regarding your content. And what is this content? It's Eminence and Shadow season one finale. My most viewed video on the channel. So you're telling me on the same time where he's getting cooked and realizes he can't do anything. I get an automated response from a YouTube support team saying, motherfuckers are reporting about privacy complaint. And you know what the best part of the privacy complaint is? Look at this. The information reported as violating the privacy is that this number, and it's a fake phone number. You're supposed to provide a fucking timestamp, you retard. You're supposed to provide a timestamp on when your private information was leaked on a video. Bro put in random numbers, grasping a straws, cause he's so mad. He's so fucking mad that, you know, he got banned from my community for being a piece of shit. And listen, I don't ban people randomly. No, no, no. I have a very firm grasp on my community. I ban at fucking will. If you're spoiling, if you're being rude to others, if you're pissing me off, I immediately cut off that fucking cancer. I am not a fucking PG-13 white knight content creator trying to appease everyone. Oh, oh no, if I, if I ban somebody, if I call someone out, they're gonna stop watching me. Fuck you, loser mindset. 
content creators should not conform to their audience. The audience conforms to the content creator because they have that unique personality that makes them them and I don't need to be anyone I'm not. And because I'm so fucking brutally honest, because I straight up tell you that I'm a petty piece of shit, people think it's funny. People continue to sp support me because they know that it's fucking authentic and genuine. And now I got these deranged fucking losers. I tell them to stop watching. I ban them. I say unsubscribe, move on. This loser right now is in an alt account watching my stream, watching every YouTube video, trying to figure out, is he gonna slip up here? Is he gonna slip up there? Oh, I need to take him down, dude. Just fucking know that this is the most loser pathetic behavior one could possibly do. You have a limited finite moment on this earth. If you're in school, if you're going to work, Half your fucking day is already gone and you come home and you're too fucking tired and you try to enjoy your life by doing things you enjoy, being part of a community, watching content, creating content, hanging out with friends. But this motherfucker treats this like a full-time job, jobless, friendless, fatherless, grassless, goes around trying to fucking start fabricating random drama with different fucking content creators in an anime reaction face, really. Of all the fucking niches, something as niche and strange as anime reaction. You're out here doing this shit. What an absolute pathetic fucking loser. I'm so glad I banned your ass early on. And I'm so glad that my community was so strong and united that you guys were able to defend me without me going in. And you know what the best part is? And I say this over and over. Truth doesn't need to be defended. Because they'll simply come to light. I don't have to go to these fucking stupid threads and type and defend saying, no, you're a fake. No, no, no. The people know the truth. Don't insult the average intelligence of us monkeys. Alone, we are weak, but united, monkey strong. And just if anything, I just I just feel bad for the brothers, yo, man. I just feel bad that they're just trying to watch this fucking reaction. And they got retards coming out of fucking nowhere. Well, maybe we boosted the engagement for them, right? Maybe we could argue that by going in and having these stupid ass arguments that we were able to boost the, you know, engagement for their videos and they're going to have more success. Regardless, that's pretty much the drama cap, man. There's these idiots that get banned, that get, takes it so personally. They try to, you know, impersonate other people, try to throw shade. But where's the proof? I'm squeaky clean. Everything is public. All about me is an open book. You know why? Because I got nothing to fucking hide. But you, you are hiding behind an anonymous fucking account. You have multiple separate fucking bot accounts. You are an absolute loser that has nothing going for you. You are the type of just cockroach that shouldn't even exist, right? You are literally a waste of life. Imagine other people dying from cancer. Imagine children not having an opportunity to grow up because they were fucked with the genetic lottery. And then you got monkeys like him. You got idiots like this guy that waste their entire fucking life doing this grassless behavior, man. Trash, absolute trash. And yes, I will fucking farm your ass make more money, get even bigger. Other CCs will realize how based our community is. We're gonna fucking network, we're gonna collaborate, we're gonna get even bigger, and you are gonna be in the same position in the next three to five years. My channel is gonna go fucking beyond. I'm gonna fucking live my dreams while you're gonna continue fucking hating because you don't know how to fucking move forward. Fuck you.